Hello everyone, it's Cindy with Monarch Mom DIY. On my channel, I share with you the best tips and tools for creating home decor on a budget. Today, I am doing a chalk paint comparison video, comparing these six brands of chalk paint to see which one I think is the best. If you're new here and enjoy budget home decor DIYs, I hope you'll consider subscribing and sticking around. These are the six brands of chalk paint that I chose to compare for this video. I decided to do ones that were easily available at local craft stores, Walmart, places like that. So here is my setup. You can see I have my six different paints. I have brand new brushes and I'm going to test them on both wood and glass. The first one is Art Mines Matte Distressing Paint, Chalk Paint from Michaels. Second is Craft Smart. It is in the color French Teal. It is their multi-surface premium chalky acrylic. Deco Art Americana Decor Chalky Finish Paint. Folk Art Home Decor Chalk Paint. Ultra Matte Acrylic Paint. Next is the Kills Chalk Style Paint. This I purchased at Walmart. You can also get it on Amazon. And our Waverly Chalk Paint by Plaid. Now I'll talk a little bit more about two of these are from plaid.com. So I decided to keep everything as same as possible. I got six new brushes. I have one of these square pieces of wood and also a glass jar to test each paint. Each of these paints are brand new. I did go ahead and remove the inner lining, but they are brand new, opened today, not been used. I'm giving them a good shake and stir, and we'll just see how they do covering the glass jar and also the wood square. One thing that I did not keep the same because I didn't want a bunch of chalk paint of different brands in the same color is I did decide to do different colors in these chalk paints, but I think we'll still get a really good idea of how well each brand covers no matter what color it is. The Art Minds chalk paint comes in 15 different colors. Next, we'll try out the Craft Smart Chalky Acrylic Paint from Michaels. This I got in a two ounce bottle, but it is also available in eight ounce and 16 ounce. I thought this color was really pretty, and this had a good thickness to it. The two ounce container costs $1.99. The eight ounce is $7.49. And this Craft Smart in the two ounce size, there are 18 different colors. Eight ounce, there are 11 different colors. The third chalk paint is the Deco Art Chalky Finish. This I did also order from Michaels, but you can get this at Hobby Lobby and Joann's as well. This one seemed a little bit more watery, although it's still covered really well. It just seemed to not be quite as thick as the first two as I was going through here. So this, um, brand of paint comes in 2, 4, 8, and 16 ounce, but I'm just kind of comparing the 8 ounce containers in all these brands. This one, 8 ounce, was $9.49. 
from Michaels, like I said, and this brand comes in 16 different colors. Our next paint is the Folk Art Home Decor Chalk Paint. Now I would say this one was the thickest so far. Um, it covered really well and I was really pleased. I have to say I have used this brand before. Um, you can find this sometimes at Walmart, but it's also available at Michaels, Joann's, Hobby Lobby. Um, I have actually used this brand before to refinish some tables. So like I said, this one was the thickest so far of all the ones that I had tested. This folk art does come in two ounce and eight ounce. The eight ounce container is $9.99, even though I bought the two ounce. Um, and it comes in 19 different colors. Next is our Kills Chalk Style Paint from Walmart. This only comes in one size. This is 32 ounces for $19.99. Um, I purchased white. It only had a couple other colors there. According to Kills website, it comes in 14 different colors but there were only two or three at Walmart that day. Now, 32 ounces for $20 comes out to about $5 for eight ounces. So this paint is the least expensive per ounce. However, I was very surprised at how watery it was compared to the other ones. So the fact that you have to buy such a large amount, that might be a deterrent to some people committing $20 to one color. But I wanted to give it a try because I haven't tried this before. And that again is the Kills Chalk Style Paint. You can get it at Walmart or on Amazon. And the last chalk paint we're trying out is a brand new bottle of Waverly chalk paint in the color Mineral. If you guys have been around my channel very long at all, you know that Waverly is pretty much what I use. However, I did want to try out some of these other brands and see, you know, if there was maybe something that was a little better uh, bang for my buck. Um, and readily available. Now Waverly, we all know, is available at Walmart, so that's probably why I started using it because I also buy my groceries and things at uh, Walmart and can get it at the same time. So the eight ounce container of Waverly chalk paint is currently $6.54 at Walmart, and it also does come, some colors come in two ounce size, and some come in the 16 ounce size. But what is wonderful about Waverly is you can, when it's not COVID, order from the plaidonline.com website and there are 31 different colors of Waverly chalk paint. I had no idea because Walmart only carries about 15 different colors. So that is an amazing deal. Um, you guys know I love the Waverly chalk paint. Uh, this was number six of the six that I tried out. This paint, and if you remember the folk art I said were the thickest ones that I used. And those two paints are by the same company. They're both by Plaid. Um, I don't know if that has anything to do with it, but those two I thought were the thickest and had the best coverage. So here you can see my wood squares for the first three and the last three paints. Let's look at how each paint looked, finished when everything was dry. This is the Art Minds Chalk Paint in Pale Moon. You can see here the wood and the glass. I would say this would need one coat for wood, probably two coats to completely cover something in glass. Next is Craft Smart Premium Chalky Paint in French Teal. This had really good coverage, I felt and would need one coat for wood, one 
maybe two for glass. I think with one coat here, this did a pretty good job on the glass. Number three was the Deco Art Americana Decor Chalky Finish Paint. This was in, oh, yesteryear was the color. It's a light gray. I would say one coat for wood and one coat for glass. This had pretty good coverage. Those are just some fingerprints on the glass there because I touched it wet. Number four was the Folk Art Home Decor Chalk Paint. Again, remember I said this was the thickest I felt coming out of the bottle. For the wood, one coat, one, maybe two for glass. But I still thought this was a really, really good chalk paint. I should also say that all of these are water-based and non-toxic. The Kills Chalk Style Paint in white, again from Walmart. I would say probably two coats to completely cover the wood and two for glass. So the fact that this is less per ounce, you'd have to use two coats so that kind of defeats the purpose. The Waverly Chalk Paint, again, one of the two that was the thickest out of the bottle. And I would say only one coat needed for wood, one, maybe two for glass, but this covered pretty well with one coat on the glass. So of the six that I tested today, I am really going to have to say that I think I'm going to stick with my Waverly chalk paint. Um, it's 82 cents per ounce when you buy the eight ounce. It's readily available at my Walmart and comes in 31 colors. I also think once the whole COVID pandemic is done, I'm going to try ordering from their website some of the colors I don't find at my Walmart. Let me know in the comments what you guys thought of this video, and I'll see you soon.